I watched the news networks. They were recounting everything that took place in 2018. And it seemed like one disaster after another disaster after another disaster. Well, that doesn't make up a life. What makes up a life are the good things that happen. And that is what I ask you to recall, because the more that you count your blessings, the more you realize you have a good life. And sure, there will be times, days that aren't as good as others, but I ask you to focus on the good and to focus on what is right and thanking God for what is right. It says in Psalms 103, verse 1, Bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me. Bless God's holy name. Sometimes, the more complex life seems, the more we need to keep things very simple. The one thing that is simple for us to do and is of great benefit is to count our blessings. Acknowledging one blessing soon leads to the discovery of others. As suggested in a well-known song, we count our blessings. We name them one by one and give heartfelt thanks to God. And in doing so, we release all negativity and sense of lack. We know that God is the source of all good and that we are open and we're receptive to it. There is good even in what may seem to be a difficult situation. Some of the best things in my life have come from terrible situations in the moment. And I didn't realize that there was a grander plan at work. Well, looking back, I realize it now. And I pray you do too. We do not hold grudges in our mind. We forgive others and we release them to their greater good. And as we count our blessings and name them one by one, it's one of the most positive ways to go into a new time, a new year. We are filled with joy and thanksgiving as we go across the threshold to even greater good.